Hello. So if you are having problems with your shipping, uh, and it's coming up that there is saying that no shipping uh, is available in your WooCommerce site, <clears throat> if you go to WooCommerce settings, let's go back to the beginning. So WooCommerce settings, on these tabs, click shipping. So you want to enable shipping. Um, whether you want the calculator on the cart page, not sure. Um, so there's different things here. You can default to the billing address or default to the shipping address. I guess you'd want that one. Um, so you can ship to all countries. You can ship to various different, if you just want to keep it within the UK or whatever your country is. Um, and you can uh, select them here. Now, uh, this is the problem that's been coming up here. So uh, we've had a site and it's saying... <clears throat> then there's no shipping things. Now if you look down here, here's all the options, the methods. This is saying enabled, nothing's enabled. So if we want to say charge 399, if we click flat rate here, it will take you into that uh, thing. We want to enable it. What do you want to call it? So UK delivery first class, for instance, something like that. To all the allowed countries, maybe it's just like the UK, for instance. Okay, because we don't want to uh, we don't want to send three ninety nine. You know, if we're doing it, and so we're going to put in here three ninety nine. So we're going to save those changes. Okay. So now that should come up as a delivery option. Now the other thing, so you could allow free shipping if you wanted that. Now free shipping, so if you wanted orders over a certain value like £30 could be free, so you could enable that, say free shipping, but it requires a minimum order amount um, of £50 for instance, and then that would allow people that when they've ordered £50, free shipping would kick in. Now if you wanted to ship internationally, so obviously £3.99 was for our UK, if you wanted to ship internationally, Enable, probably call it international, select the countries you want to ship to, maybe you want to select all of them, um, and then uh, whatever you want to ship internationally, okay? You can also have local delivery here. Um, so again, you could, you know, maybe if you're local you could offer free delivery if you wanted to and you'd put in postcodes here. Um, but again, that's up to you. Now, there are shipping plugins that you can install that give you a little bit more flexibility so you can have uh, next day delivery and things like that. So there are things that you can upgrade if you want to, but at the beginning, I'd keep it very simple. Uh, you know, you can always say to contact me if, if your order's in, you know, urgent and we can um, charge a bit more or something like that. But there are some plugins that you can add uh, that, that can add in other options but that is basically if you're having that issue that's where you need to go so you need to go to shipping so if you go back to shipping options now we should see that this is enabled okay I'm not going to enable free shipping but you can just do that exactly like I've just shown you and you can um, you can add it all in there so that is if you've got any problems with shipping